I like this little house. It's out kind of in the outskirts of town. It's like a suburb. It's in the suburbs of Bodie. Um, we're facing the general direction that this Milky Way will be kind of rising up. If I can light that window up from the back side somehow, um, with the 14 millimeter vertical or something going right up. This is also the lowest horizon we have here, right? The, the horizon's low enough. And if I get down low, that thing will start cutting way down low. And uh, I think this has some potential. And maybe this has greater potential than the first house I looked at. It's a little smaller and it's a little lonelier on the prairie, which sort of matches more the idea of the star fields above. I think that it's just sort of out in the middle of nowhere. Right, you know, that kind of deal. So let's see if I can get into the window with a little bit of light back here. Yeah, nothing, yes, okay. There's a hole right here. There's the window right there. I could actually put a light right here and just have it glowing there and I'll bet it would illuminate the interior for 20 seconds. Um, see if there's something else around the back that would work as well. We got a screen back here. Does that go all the way to the front? It does. So we could even set, I could just set a headlamp maybe right here, just going right through there. Not that the light goes through the window, it just needs to light up the interior of the building just a little bit. And you just let that cook for the whole 20 seconds. And then all of a sudden it looks like somebody's home. And then here are these star fields and it, it comes alive. It's the same thing will happen with, if we light up the headlights of the truck, it looks like the truck's working. Like it's alive, it has a battery or something in it when it really doesn't. Um, I know that's hard to imagine at this point in time in the class, but it'll happen. Cool.